Two brief three-second segments of my video from four and a half years ago were used in a bag bomb anthem or commercial made for the bag bomb website. It's not 15 seconds of fame, but it was fun to be included in the project. They have a nice website, tells a bit about their history, various uses for bag bomb, and it shows their entire product line. Enjoy their following anthem. Farming in uh, in Vermont or anywhere, because you know you know there's a whole stretch goes right right across the country that I mean it's just as hard in the Midwest as it is here. When I graduated from high school, my mother said, "Do you ever think about running this farm?" And I said, "Well, I hadn't really thought about it. I don't really like getting up at five o'clock in the morning." I gradually warmed up to it and. It's been 42 years since we started milking, and I haven't regretted anything. It's good. The way my father and grandfather had to do things was a lot harder than how I have to do things. Everything was done by hand. You have to respect them for that, because they were pretty amazing people. I can remember my father having a can of bag bomb on the windowsill out there uh, back when I was a little kid. And I can still see it sitting there. The first memory of the green tin coming out, the unique smell of the product, the way it, it went on the skin. The bag bomb is one of those classic Vermont brands that just screams authenticity. And our job is to bring back the memory and let you know that Bagram is alive and well and is still doing the job it was doing 116 years ago. This is perhaps the most versatile skincare product on the market today. Do yourself a favor, try a can of this stuff. Hi, my name is George Woodard. Woodard, that's with one W and it's at the beginning. Make for a lasting handshake. Give it a shot.